Hello heroes and villains, welcome to Multiverse. So we have a new time capsule that's been added to the game. So we have a new time capsule that's been added to the game, the Batman Eternal Time Capsule. So you can see the rewards on the Tut Tut Emote Collection, the Perplexing Material Collection, the Lumos Aura Collection, the Lumos Chroma Pack, the Enhanced Final Bat Suit Gear, and the Final Bat Suit Gear. And of course, there's Ant Metal, Ally Favor Catalyst, and more. And there's also a whole bunch of emblems. And when you open 15 of those time capsule, you do get the Bombshell Batman doll accessory. For the Tutut Emote, the Perplexing Material, and the Lumos Aura, you have to get 12 collections in order to be able to get those. The Lumos Chroma Pack should be a random drop as you open the time capsule. And if you take a look at the bottom and the descriptions, you can see the odds of getting those items. So sadly, for the Tutut Emote and the Perplexing Materials, you have less than 1% chances to get those. It's sad, but that's how it is. For the Lumos Aura and the Lumos Chroma, you have 2.9% chances to get those. And then you can see the odds for everything else. So sadly, if you're looking for one very specific item, like let's say the Lumos Chroma Pack, I would strongly suggest don't open a whole bunch of time capsule, just buy it from the broker. We can already see the Lumos Chroma Pack uh, on the broker for about uh, 79 million. But the price will drop. Uh, sadly, this is the price people are asking right now. But uh, tomorrow, next week, the price will go down. I guarantee it. So if you are looking only for one specific item, and don't open a whole bunch of time capsule, just buy the item you need from the broker. Yes, you will have to play the broker game, but it is a much safer way to be able to get the, what you want than opening a whole bunch of time capsule, hoping to get what you want. And sadly, very often, at the end of the day, you end up not having what you want after opening time capsule. It's sad, but that's how it is. So time capsule drop roughly every 20 minutes of gameplay, and you need to use one stabilizers to unlock those time capsule. I did accumulate a few uh, free stabilizers, but uh, we are going to open the time capsule from the marketplace. Uh, you can purchase the time capsule directly from our marketplace, and these are already unlocked. So you can see you can purchase either one time capsule or a bundle of 25 time capsule. You can't really miss the, uh, the bundles of 25 time capsule, it is in the featured tab. So you can see here in the description what you get in the time capsule, although I'm not sure why they don't list the emblems, oh well. So again, it is literally the very same thing. The one distinction is that if you purchase them from the marketplace, obviously you don't need stabilizers to open them. So let's start opening them right now. Ah, decisions, decisions. Normally I would go for the collections, but uh, I don't really care about the Lumos Aura so much, so let us go with the gear this time. I wasn't planning to take uh, collections from the emote, but uh, well, let's take this one. So let us consume the collection. Let's go for the collection, I really want the replacing material. Let us consume it. And the Lumos Aura. Now let's go for the, the pants. Oh, the back piece. We're gonna go for that one, obviously. And the forever Batman might have been tempting, but uh, I'm sure we'll be able to get it easily enough. And it is the enhanced uh, back piece, so even better. If we're lucky, we might be able to get the whole suit today. Eh, we're gonna have to wait and see for that. Now let's go for the enhanced the shoulders. Oh, the chest piece. Let's go for that. It's a bit unusual. Usually I go for the collections first, but not today. Now let us go for the bat by emblem. I did just uh, in one of the comments that uh, they would give us the bat by emblem. I uh, never thought that that would actually happen. Although I should have known at this point, uh, the devs uh, do like to give us some uh, wacky stuff from time to time. Oh, back might again, but we already have it. Let's go for the belt. Yeah, the belt, uh, we're gonna get the dozen belts, but oh well. Oh, we got another collection for a King Tut. Uh, let's go for that. And let us consume it. Oh, 
already have the legs, so let's go for the enhanced uh, laughing pad. And let us consume it so that we know that we already have it. And as you can see, as you consume it, it does give us a feed. Usually the pattern is that the enhanced emblem give us a feat, and then when you get all the enhanced emblem, you get another feat, another feat. I suspect it's going to be the same. Uh, let's go for the boots. Uh, let's go for the emblem. Uh, let us consume it. So as you saw, there's no feat if you consume a regular emblem. Although if you collect all the regular emblems, then you will get a feat. Ooh, the collection or the helmet. Well, let's go for the helmet. We'll try the collection a bit later. Also, we might be able to get the whole suit. Uh, we'll see. And as you saw, we got a feat for opening 15 in time capsule. And uh, as luck would have it, we got the Twisted Ancient Academics. Uh, let's go for that. Uh, let's see how much people are asking for it. So you can see it started at uh, 65 million, but the price is going down uh, fairly quickly. It was one of those things that either it would be really, really popular because it, uh, it's a wacky, uh, pretty much a wacky emote, or it wouldn't be popular at all. So we've opened 15 uh, time capsule, so we will get the Batman doll accessory by mail. Uh, but while we wait, let's open the rest of our time capsules. Uh, we already have the belt, we already have the Batmite emblem, so let's go for the collection. Uh, let us consume it. So again, one, one out of 12, so we need 12 collections uh, every time. From the time capsule, it's pretty much always uh, 12 collections. Oh, the gloves. So I will be able to show you the full style by mix and matching uh, the Adams version and the regular version of the style. Ah, the Future State Emblem would be tempting. Uh, let's go for the collection. Uh, let's go for the collection. We have a pro boots, so let us go with the enhanced augmented uh, vengeance emblem. Uh, in this case, let's go for the collection. Uh, let us consume it. Oh, we already have the collection. Uh, let's go for the emblem. Uh, sadly, people have been asking and asking for a Batman uh, Beyond Emblem, and this is the emblem they gave us instead. Uh, what can you do? Uh, let's go for the collection. The collection would be tempting, but uh, let's go for the pants. And our last time capsule. Uh, let's go for the collection. Uh, overall, it is a nice emblem, but it's not exactly what people were asking for. Uh, once I do get all the emblems, I will make a video about those emblems. See, we got mail. So let us collect our uh, doll accessory. And let us consume it. We already had a Batman doll accessory, but now we do have the bombshell Batman doll accessory. So here we can see it. So if you like those kind of dolls, you will get one more of those. I'm assuming they must be somewhat popular because we keep getting uh, some of those. Although it could just be that the devs uh, love those dolls and keeps on giving them to us. We'll never know. And now let us take a look at the gear. So the gear is minimum item level 10, maximum item level 352. So let's see. So it does give us a maximum. And obviously as usual you can choose between uh, DPS or whatever role you have. In this case it doesn't really matter. Uh, my gear is better than this. 
Oh, I forgot to remove the material. Well, let's take a look at it with the material. That's look really, uh, really sweet. Oh, I don't have the material in the back piece. I'm so sad now. So here we can see what the style looks like with a mishmash of the regular version and the enhanced version. Obviously, once I get the full regular version, I'll make a video about it. And the same once I get the full enhanced version. And here you can see what the armor looks like underneath. So there you go guys, so we got a new time capsule today. And time capsules usually last between 8 to 12 weeks. So you will have at the very least 8 weeks to be able to get everything you need from this time capsule. But odds are, uh, it'll probably be more like 12 weeks. Obviously, once I get all the emblems, all the styles, all the materials, I'll make a video about it.